Good day viewers, you are welcome. Here we have the interesting algebraic equations. We have t multiplied by t multiplied by t divided by t plus t plus t equals 9 divided by t. And we want to find all the values of t that satisfy this problem. So if you consider the solution here by multiplying t by t by t we are going to have t raised to the power of 1 plus 1 plus 1 according to the rule of indices divided by and if you add t plus t we are going to have 3 t equals 9 divided by t then adding the power together we have t raised to power 3 divided by 3t equals 9 divided by t. After this, let's cross multiply. By cross multiplying, we have t raised to the power of 3 multiplied by t equals 9 multiplied by 3t. Then, if this is t power of 1, t raised to power 3 multiplied by t raised to power 1, that gives us t raised to power of 4. Equals 9 multiplied by 3t, this is 27t. But we are interested to get all the solutions. But first is, if you have t raised to power of 4 minus 27t equals 0. If I factor out t, we are going to have this as t raised to the power 3 minus 27 equals 0. <coughs> if t equals to 0, then we still have t raised to the power 3 minus 27 equals 0. Though t equals to 0 is not our solution because of the fraction that we have. We don't want to have an undivided equation. Therefore, this t is going to be rejected as we are going to be looking into t raised to the power 3 minus 27 equals 0 if you can get uh, the other solutions here. So, what we do is, here is a cubic equations as we are interested to get three solutions. And how can we achieve that? It's very simple by just writing t raised to power 3 minus 27 is the same thing as t raised to power 3 equals 0. Then, here is in the form of difference of two kit. Where when we have something of these expressions, what we do is by applying this formula as a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3, this equals a minus b. So anywhere we see this, this is what we are going to write as a squared plus a b plus b squared. So this is the equivalence value of difference of two cubed. Then replacing t cubed minus three cubed with a cubed minus b cubed, we are going to have t minus three. Then multiply by t squared plus 3t plus 9 equals 0. Then having this, we are going to get the first solution here as t equals 3. Yes, t must be equals to 3 for all this side to be equals 0. Then what about the other two solutions? Because it's a cubic, we are getting three solutions. Let's see how we can get the other three solutions. We've gotten the first value of t, which is 3. And here comes a quadratic equation as well, which requires two answers. What we do is, if we get the value of a as 1, b is 3, and c equals 9. Then, let's also understand the concept of discriminant, which is b squared minus 4ac, to know the nature of this root. If d equals b squared minus 4ac, and we plug in this, we are going to have 9 minus 36. And 
this gives us minus 27. This less than 0, which shows that discriminant is com uh, the, the roots are complex because discriminant less than 0. So we have gotten discriminant, and uh, if you apply this in a quadratic formula as t equals minus b, that's going to be minus 3 plus or minus the square root of minus 27 divided by 2. As we have already know that this is a complex solution, then we are going to get the complex value here as minus 3 plus or minus 3 square root of 3i then divided by 2. So this is what we have for the other two roots. Then <coughs> can we just verify if these are truly equal? So to check, we consider from at t equals 3. We are giving t multiplied by t multiplied by t divided by t plus t plus t equals 9 divided by t. And substituting we have 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3 divided by 3 plus 3 plus 3 equals 9 divided by 3 and here we have 27 divided by 9 equals 9 divided by 3 obviously these are equal because 27 in uh, 9 in 27 that is 3 and uh, 3 in 9 that is also 3 the left hand side equals the right hand side but what of the complex part of this Actually, that is going to be complex as well. So I can leave that one for you. So let's see the answer in the comment box. Bye-bye.